destination 34 and 35 took us to Nevada and then also to Lake Tahoe, California. Since plans change, it seems, all the time on this trip, we're going to put a state on there that I didn't think that we would ever put on there. So we're putting Nevada on there because we are camping here right now. Off grid. Off grid in Winnemucca or Winnemucca. Winnemucca, baby. Mucca. Named after an Indian chief. All right. Uh, we are at Water Canyon today in Winnemucca, Nevada. So this is uh, Bureau of Land Management land and it's free camping out here. So we got it here at about five o'clock today and I was worried that we weren't gonna get a spot because we were getting here so late. But uh, in this cul-de-sac area here, which is the middle part of the canyon, there's a uh, pit toilet back there. And we're amongst all these aspens. We're not even gonna unhook because we're only here for two days, uh, two nights. But we have a creek back here. You can hear the creek. It was a relatively short but beautiful drive to get to Lake Tahoe. We're climbing up the side of Round Mountain, Lake Tahoe. Whew. Steep, 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 steep. Still on our hike today. We just got done hanging out at Nevada Beach and now we're hiking through Rabe Meadows. The last time I was in Lake Tahoe was with my parents as a little kid. Charmaine had never been. We both decided that this is one of our most favorite destinations on this trip. Not only is the scenery absolutely amazing, but there's a ton of things to do in Lake Tahoe. We took in multiple hikes and also did a mountain bike ride. There are tons of restaurants in the area that actually serve really good food. And if you're into gambling, there are casinos there as well. Well, we're out on the lake today kayaking and we decided we were originally going to go to uh, Emerald Bay but it's uh, kind of far out and it was totally packed. It would have taken us about a mile to hike down to the bottom to carry the kayak. So we kind of opted against that. We ended up going to Meeks Bay Park and we hung out over there and uh, then paddled all the way from Meeks Bay over here to Rubicon Bay. And if you look out there, just beyond that point, which is where we were trying to get to, which is just took us a long time. Uh, it, Emerald Bay is down over there on the other side, but it's not feasible for us to go walking down there. And Charmaine's out here finding feathers. But uh, the water is crystal clear, as you can see. And it's just beautiful out here, so we're having a good time and enjoying ourselves today on the lake.
are out at the uh, Fallen Leaf Lake Trail today. It's our last full day in Lake Tahoe. So we decided to finish it up with a nice little three mile hike. I forgot the GoPro back at the hotel. I don't know why, but hopefully I'll be able to catch some good video here without the wide angle lens effect that Charmaine always complains about. After completing this loop and on our way back to the car, Charmaine spotted a small family of black bears roaming through a nearby meadow. Unfortunately, we were not able to capture them on camera because they were pretty far away. decided that we will be coming out to Lake Tahoe again because we loved it so much. Next, we're continuing our journey through California and we'll end up in Klamath Falls to go see the Redwoods.